Looking back at our progress in the last year, we've accomplished a lot of great things. In addition to that, we failed a lot too. We are still calling it a trial. And the reason that we're calling it a trial is because we do not have everything figured out yet. There's not a book written on how to do this, but we are trying to take these practices and implement them into our production system in a way that minimizes our risk, but at the same time offers the reward that we're looking for. There is a collaborative spirit inside the company around this endeavor. We've had a lot of support at the top. We're excited by the progress that we made, but we're also very humbled by what we're learning. We're doing a side-by-side -side study looking at both the regeneratively organically grown soils and comparing them to our standard tilled soils to try to better understand what is changing as we change our practices. In 2022, we harvested 22 acres of regenerative organically grown product. In 2023, we more than doubled that and harvested 70 acres of regenerative grown organic product. Of those acres, we trialed nine different commodity crops. From all that acreage, we netted over 17,000 cartons of product that you can see on the shelves at grocery stores under the Josie's Organics label. Within those commodity crops, we grew seven different permanent plantings, including different species of grass that would replace our deep tillage. We're measuring the successes and failures of this program through 15 different metrics. Seven of those metrics are specific to soil health. In 2023, we took a total of 58 soil samples to measure our soil health. By buying Josie's organic, regeneratively grown product and paying the premium price associated with that product, you're helping us offset the failures that we have and helping us with our research and development that we're completely collaborative with. When we're out in the field sharing our successes and failures with other folks in the industry, we get a lot of excitement. People are asking, are we yielding? Are we actually bringing this product to market? And it's really important to say, yes, we are getting this product to market. That being said, we faced a lot of challenges and the transparency around our journey has been really important for us. The regenerative space demands collaboration to move us forward. When we share our learnings, we benefit our industry as a whole. Braga was recognized in association with Agrology for tech and innovation by the International Fresh Produce and Floral Association at the convention in Anaheim. And in 2023, our CEO Rod Braga was awarded Organic Grower of the Year by Western Growers and the Organic Produce Network. What you'll see on the mark is regenerative carbon capture farming, healthy soil, clean air to save our earth. Those are all things we at Braga stand behind. We hope that the mark that we're using on this product will help educate consumers as to what we're doing to enhance sustainability of all farms. I think it's really exciting to see that we are actually doing what we say we're doing and to see it happen on farm and then to see that in the grocery store brings me a lot of pride. We would love for our customers to come along on this journey with us.